Hey everybody, we're back. We took care of those guys. Yeah, straight up fucking massacre. And we lit that bonfire. Got lit. Oh, oh wait, wrong game. Woo, woo. We're always getting lit, no matter what game we're playing. Is there a game where you don't get lit? Psh. No. God damn right. Even in the worst games, you get lit. Mm hmm. So sometimes you have to get lit for the worst games. <laughs> True that. Ah. <laughs> Man, that looks totally like a bonfire from Dark Souls 3. I know. Like an area where you would find a bonfire. Well, guess what? I'm oh. rest. <laughs> <laughs> it basically is. Yeah. I forgot this was a thing. <laughs> I'm a survivor. I'm not gonna give up. I'm a survivor. Keep on surviving. Dude, she's getting beat up. What are you talking about? Look, she got that dirt on her face. Hey, I like a, I like a lady with a little dirt on her face. Yeah, dirt is sexy. Mm. Who doesn't mm. have a dirt fetish? Mm. <laughs> Damn. Oh yeah, I got that breath control. Mm. Who doesn't like a lady with some breath control? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gotta get that pump action. <laughs> and if you're in the dudes, who doesn't like a dude with that breath control? And that pump action. Oh, uh, <laughs> get pumped. Hmm. I don't want to use that one. It's got like no damage. There's a Dark Souls gesture that's called pump up. Yeah? Yeah. That's all I gotta say about that. All right. Magazine extender. And that's all. I got a, I got a bigger magazine for my shotgun. Nice. Oh, what's that, Lara? You want to get warm? Too bad. We're going on an adventure. We don't got time for that, Lara. We're Bilbo Baggins in it. We don't got time for your problems. We're Bilbo Baggins in it. Yeah. I'm getting shot at. Martin Freeman Bilbo Baggins. Where are you going? I'm going on an adventure. Martin Freeman's awesome. He's also in Sherlock. I know he is. So you should. That's build. what makes me want to watch Sherlock. Why don't, don't you? I mean, I don't know if I like Benedict Cumberbatch or not yet, but Martin Freeman's what makes me want to watch it. Just, I don't know. I got a lot of shows to watch. I will watch it someday. I just got a lot to watch. I got a lot to watch. I need this guy to walk back over here. I know you want to, guy. I know you want to. I know you want to. <laughs> Fuck it. You know what else Martin Freeman's in? Dead. UK office. You know what else he's in? A lot. First but season what? of Fargo. Oh yeah? I haven't mm -hmm. seen that either. You know what else he's in? Um, Captain America Civil War. Really? Yep. Well, who is he? I don't fucking know. <laughs> I, think he, I think they say he's playing like a smaller part, but he's in it. Mm. Like, is he a hero? No. I think he's the dude who draws up the uh, thing that they're fighting about. Gotcha. Like the government thing. Mm -hmm. That's making them fight. Gotcha. Yeah, you got it. Have you ever watched the UK office? Uh, I've watched a few episodes. It's pretty good. I didn't watch the whole thing, but yeah, I only watched a few couple of a few episodes also, but it's pretty good. Yeah, you watched a few F U episodes. <laughs> 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 yeah, am I supposed to make that jump? Or am I supposed to jump down there? Am I supposed to make that jump? I feel like I'm supposed to do neither. <laughs> I think I can do it. Oh, yeah, I can totally make it. There you go. Swanging. He's swanging. But yeah, Myron Freeman's really cool in the office. Laura's got that big dick swanging. <laughs> and so is that guy, Ricky. Whatever. Ricky Gervais. Oh, Ricky Gervais. Yeah, that guy. He's cool. watch it with subtitles though because I have a hard time keeping up with what they're saying. <laughs> you ever watch uh, the IT crowd? No. That's a pretty good show. I have not heard of that. I really... Well, there's a lot of shows I want to watch but now I'm starting to want to watch um, Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt because yeah. everybody's talking about it. Woo! I might just binge that one because it's pretty short. Well, I mean so far. And I really like that. I don't know that girl's name, but I really like her. She was in the office. 
Yeah. Whoa, how is this guy still alive? He's lit. I shot him in the fucking head. And I think I got experience for it too. Glitches, man. How do people hit us through walls in Dark Souls 3? Glitches. I ain't got time for those. For glitches? Yeah. You know what they say about glitches? Hmm. They for bitches. Oh, snap. Got your ass. Got your ass. Don't be a bitch. <laughs> Get rid of them glitch. Sometimes glitches save time. Speedrunners love glitches. That's not that's not legit. I want to see them beat the game at the fastest way possible. 100%ing it. 100. Keeping it 100. Well, that's uh, usually a category in speedruns is glitchless. Good. But most people don't do that. <laughs> yeah, because cause they're little, little whiny babies. If I ever did a speedrun, I would definitely do glitchless because I think that's... It just feels a lot cooler. That's that's the pure way of doing it. Yeah. And honestly, it seems easier <laughs> than having to like pull off these glitches. I yeah. Don't know. It just doesn't I'm, feel as legit. After like when we came back to this game, mm -hmm. we're like, it doesn't look as good as we remember. But I think it's starting to look good again. Yeah, maybe like maybe Dark Souls Three just looks better. So like that we're just getting more used to that. Yeah. So, like, when we first look at this, we're like, oh, man. But after we get, like, more into it, we're like, oh, yeah, it looks pretty good still. Ah, the lighting. <laughs> Doing it again. Yeah, the lighting in Dark Souls 3 is so good that it breaks the game. <laughs> yeah. We've learned from that firsthand. Yeah, and they still haven't patched it four patches later. True. They probably just can't figure it out. Fuck you, Konami. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, FromSoft, though, they're, like, to the point where I'd probably buy anything from them. Yeah. Because I just, I really trust them. Would you buy drugs from them? Yeah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo! Woo, I didn't die. I want to buy, like, the old FromSoft games before they got famous from the Souls games. Yeah. Like, uh, Kingsfield, I think they're called. Those games. Mm -hmm. For PS1 and PS2. Aren't those, like, RTSs? No, they're adventure games. Oh, okay. Um, there's this thing called the Moonlight Greatsword, which is in every FromSoft game since the Kingsfield games. So, mm -hmm. like, it'll be in Dark Souls 3. Like, they, it was in Bloodborne. I, I think that's really cool. Because it's a really cool sword. And it's just cool that they have, like, that thing. Yeah. We will never be able to use it in our playthrough, because nope. we'll need like probably a lot of faith for it, because it does magic damage. Guess what? Hmm. Ain't got a lot of faith. Nah. Especially in Dark Souls 3. <laughs> it's so cool though, it's like this giant sword, and when you do the R2 charge attack, it um, it's like, you know, in like Link to the Past when you have full health and it hits out that beam. Yeah. It does like one of those. Mm. It's super cool. I've never Cut actually scene. used it though because I never had enough Skip. like magic. Oh, things are happening. Jeez. I shouldn't have skipped the cutscene. You skipped one cutscene. <laughs> and it got lit. Then don't. We can handle ourselves, lady. Oh, there's a broken rib. Yeah, I, I don't know. You're pushing your boundaries a little bit there, Lara. Oh, it's Anna. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Gotcha wow. ass, bitch. I don't know where this happened. Atlas. You have betrayed my family. <laughs> Atlas, more like Frank Fontaine, am I right? I think that was the right characters. <laughs> Bioshock. Kill her and bring me that I, I can't remember. What a good game, though, Bioshock. More like Andrew Ryan. Yeah, he was there, too. I know that one's the real yeah, name. Yeah, Andrew Ryan, he was the one who told us that Atlas was actually Frank Fontaine. Mm -hmm. What a twist. It has to be. What a twist. That game is so good. That's, like, in my top ten games. The first Bioshock? Yeah.
Yeah, I remember the first time I ever played like the demo for it, I was like, I need to buy this game. Yeah, most people played that game in 2007. <laughs> Or 2006, I think it came out. Mm -hmm. I played it in, like, 2014. <laughs> I didn't get an Xbox 360 until 2012. Which is crazy. Because I only had the Wii in that generation. Until I got the 360 in 2012. Six years later. I had a lot of catching up to do. Yeah, you did. So, yeah, I think I actually bought... I actually played Bioshock for the first time in 2012. But I didn't, like, really play it 100% through... Yeah until like 2014 and that's when i like really started to love it let's upgrade this yeah thing. i was really late to that generation yeah you were <laughs> this generation though i had almost everything like i had everything almost at launch like within a year of launch yeah i don't know that was kind of like my phase where i like wasn't super into video games and so like what? yeah and i know right awesome. So I only had the Wii, and I'll, all I really played was, like, Guitar Hero and Rock Band, and I never even played, like, Galaxy. Like, I didn't Make even play Rock the good Wii Make Rock Band great again. <laughs> I think it's over. Oh, no. Like, I didn't even play the big Wii games, though. Like, I didn't play Galaxy. I didn't play Skyward Sword. I didn't play Donkey Kong Country Returns. I didn't play, like, any of those big games. I played Wii Sports and <laughs> Guitar Hero. Yeah. It was, like... I was really excited when Rock Band 4 came back out. Yeah. Me but too. But, like, what the hell is all that? they, like, all the DLC for it has not been my type of music. Mm -hmm. Like, they've had, like, two Justin Bieber packs. Uh-huh. <laughs> and I'm just like, ah, Oh, you don't like on. Jay Beavs? No. He was just here yesterday. I'm sorry if there's any Bieber fans that are watching this. I don't like Justin Bieber. I don't either. And you know, everybody was like, with his new album, they were like, wow, he's he's really good. He's not like how he used to be. He's like a lot better now. And I gave it a listen and I was like, this is exactly the same. Yeah. Well, like, I mean, maybe people who are more into him can I know people see the differences are all like, better, but. Oh, bro, Jay Biebs is getting lit on these new tracks. And I'm like, I don't like him. Yeah, I'm not a big fan. And I'm like, it is too late to say sorry. <laughs> the, I, the, like, people who make Rock Band are in a really bad position where, like, the it's very stale. Like, yeah. because we've played those games forever. But you also can't change anything because then you'll be like Guitar Hero where nobody wants to play it because you just change the whole thing. Yeah. From what, what I got from that cutscene mm -hmm. was... She was like, if they can't find the Atlas, you never will. And the first thing we fucking do is go find the Atlas. Yeah, because we're lit. So fucking lit. Oh, jeez. Oh, it looks like oh, everybody geez. found it. Get out of there, Lara. Oh. I don't think the grenade would have had that effect when you were that far away. Well, we're going to do this on the next episode. Bye. See you guys.